Hey, what's up out there, all my lovely people? Hope you had a good round today, and if you didn't play golf, that's just too bad for you. <laughs> Welcome back, it's Mr. P, and today we're going to talk about what's in my golf bag. My bag that I have here, as you can see, is a Daytrick golf bag. I love green. This one is black and green. It's the Daytrick Light DG Light 2 cart bag. Uh, the thing, the price tag on this is around 149 bucks, 150 bucks. Got it last year, and I love this bag. Has all the pockets in. Again, it's very light. I'm originally from the island of Jamaica, as you can see from my head cover. I love this head cover, represented for my people. Big up! This is my driver. It is a tailor-made burner. It's an old driver, but it's old faithful. It um, has treated me the best over the years, so I stick with it. It's pretty beat up. I don't know if you can tell by the pictures, but it's, yeah, it's pretty beat up, but it, it treats me well. I'll probably have to get it tuned up, you know, tightened or anything like that pretty soon, or get a new one. Don't plan on it, though, unless it start, starts mistreating me. You know, sometimes these clubs can treat you terrible, um, but I'm going to be using this for a while. My fairway woods are Mizuno F50s. They're actually from 2005. I had... Tailor-made um, burner fairway woods that I was using, but I just replaced those with these woods that my friend had because he never hit them. And I love these clubs. I have a steel shaft, and this particular steel shaft helps me get the ball in the air a little bit higher for a little bit more carry. The head of the club is a little heavier than the usual. I just love this club. There's no F50s. All right, on to my irons. I finally broke down and got fitted last year because I felt it was time. I was consistently in the 80s and wanted to get into that 70s game. I've broken 80 a few times, but not consistently. So I decided to get fitted. And the best irons for me, I hit around 10 different irons. The best ones were the Callaway Rogue. And these are those. I'll get into you why I got fitted and the difference that fitting makes in a few minutes. All right, my wedges now, I play a Tom Watson wedge. It's a three pack where you get the approach wedge, gap wedge, sand wedge and lob wedge in a set together. I bought this set about seven, eight years ago when I was really working on my game and I didn't want to spend a lot of money. Three set for $99. I need new wedges. As I mentioned before, I got fitted with these Callaway Rogue irons. The reason why you get fitted is because golf clubs can sometimes be too long or too short for you, depending on your height, reach, and what have you. And the idea is to get fitted so that the golf club is angled properly so that the club head sits perfectly flat on the ground, not the heel in the ground or the toe in the ground. I got that fixed for my height and for my swing. Putter is a Nike Ignite putter. I love this putter. I bought this putter around seven years ago and it has been faithful to me. I used to have an Odyssey two ball putter, but I switched to this. The head is pretty balanced and heavy. I like a heavier putter. I also have this Frogger little ball towel that I saw someone using about a few years ago. So I picked up one for myself. Instead of, instead of carrying a big old towel to the green, just clip that to your belt. I also have this trusty golf club caddy that keeps your club standing in the air so your grips don't get wet. I also have this bag tag that you see here. Me and my boys, we have a golf crew, the Black Pack Golf Crew. We battle each week. We have two teams listed on the tag and whoever wins takes the bag tag home for the week or until the next round. As I mentioned from before, I am Jamaican born a citizen of the United States. I came here when I was a young kid, so I got a rep for my country. Proud to be an American, but I'm also very proud of my Jamaican heritage. As you can see here, this bag has a whole lot of pockets. So I have a bag uh, where I keep teas. I don't buy teas anymore because people leave teas all over the place. I just pick them up and load them in the bag. So I have a bag full of teas here. I have my golf club brush by Frogger. I also have 
skills hand position setter and then I have my divot repair tools also have a mask it's COVID season and a ball marker I also have a huge bag of um, golf balls right now I'm playing a vice golf ball that I'm testing out the red ones and a Bridgestone E12 as you can see in the pocket I also have golf gloves I don't know if you watched the previous video where I told you I like colors I have one two three four five different colors of golf gloves oh yeah I almost forgot to mention I have a, a golf ball retriever you know if your ball goes in the water in the, or the woods you know I don't hit in those places anymore because I'm nice <laughs> well there you have it that's what's in my golf bag don't forget to subscribe and share tell your friends and keep on watching and until next time enjoy your rounds